What's up guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope everyone's doing good. I hope you've been enjoying all my videos so far. And today I'm going to be going over kind of an update of what is going on with all of the Love Island couples and just kind of like where people are at. And I think a lot of people have been confused about so many different things, so I just want to clear some things up. Um, let's start with Ray and Caro. They are so cute. Um, I love seeing them on social media, like hyping each other up. You can see like Ray is always reposting her photos, like giving her, you know, support and same with him to her, or same with, uh, same with her as him as well. And now Ray just put out a new single, Do You Love Me? And Caro has been so awesome and so have like all of the Islanders really, you know, supporting him on that, spreading the word on that. So want to do my part also if you haven't heard his song yet I'll try to link it below but please go listen to it and you know share it I just hiccuped and you know share it with your friends and family and spread it it's really really catchy super cute great job Ray I love to see you guys both doing awesome things and you seem so happy and from what I last saw when I was with Carol you know she said awesome things about how you guys are doing and that's really great. So there's the update on them. Um, not a Love Island couple, but Katrina is now dating her boyfriend, Robbie. And even over the holidays, you can see all their Instagram posts together. They are so cute. They look adorable um, and just seem really happy. So congrats, Con <laughs> Katrina. You deserve it. You just like are so awesome and yeah, I knew I knew you'd find someone and end up like when you left the island. I was like, I'm not worried about you. You're great. You're amazing. You will find somebody. And of course, you know everything worked out with her and Robbie. So that's really nice and sweet. Next is Emily and Weston. And I know when they originally left the villa, were slightly rocky, but have really impressed me lately with how much they kind of have been there for each other and have been supporting each other. <coughs> Ah, why am I always sneezing? I think I'm allergic to something in my room. But, um, they, I just think Emily and Weston really complement each other, too, in a sense of they're both so goofy, they're so fun, they're both pretty driven, and just, like, going after the things that they want. They're both not afraid to take chances, and I love that about them, and I've been, like, really happy to see them succeeding in their relationship and wishing them the best. Um... Then there is Kira and Cash, and I think as a lot of you guys saw, there was a lot of back and forth with them, you know, getting together, breaking up, getting together, breaking up, and I don't know a ton about their relationship, but what I do know is that they definitely have one of those connections where it's something that you're not going to be able to understand unless you're them, like they are just, they have one of those super unique um, relationships and bond with each other that just couldn't be explained and I know they care about each other immensely so even if they aren't together at the moment you know maybe down the line something can be worked out I just know that they really care about each other but that for right now um, they are pretty much on a break or something I'm not even positive myself I feel like Kira's great and I keep in touch with her but I just sometimes like to just talk to her about, you know, other things that are going on because she probably gets a lot about that and things change with them very quickly. So it's hard for me even to stay up to date with that. But, you know, maybe I'll be a little more knowing what's going on once I move and spend some more time around Kira and just kind of see, you know, where her head's really at with all of that. Um, and then Dylan and Alex, unfortunately, are broken up. They split ways and... It was probably for the better. I think they both want really different things in life, but you know, I'm not worried about Alex. I think she's awesome. She is so fun to be around. She can make anybody laugh. She totally lights up a room. Uh, so she will be just fine. And I really want a room with Alex too. I think we're gonna check out some apartments when I get out to LA and just kind of see how, you know, we would mesh as roommates and if we're looking for the same kind of place so that would be really cool too i just rented a room for now uh in west hollywood but it'd be cool if that were to work out um oh also alex started her youtube channel so if you haven't subscribed yet please go do that that would be awesome uh 
I think her name is just Alex Stewart on YouTube, so that would be great. <laughs> Moving on to Zach and I. So we split in December. I think when we first got back from the show, everything was on such a high high that the minute we started experiencing like real life problems and real world situations that were happening, it was just a very hard adjustment on the both of us. And I think that we, you know, just started both being like super stressed out with all kinds of things happening and when we split I think it was just like we needed a break from each other and just time away from each other. We are not officially back together but we are trying to work on things and we are talking and you know just working on us and the things that we are pursuing as well individually and you know finding our career paths and what we want to do in life and how we want to move forward with things. So. I'm happy where things are at. I am, and I know he is too, but for right now, we're just trying to figure everything out. So that's like the only update that I have for you guys. Um, but yeah, we, we have been happy lately, and I know you can see us like commenting on each other's pictures on Instagram and whatnot. I just wanted to tell you that's, it's not fake. Like, that's actually like us, you know, being friendly and civil with each other and we're not trying to get your hopes up or anything but yeah we are trying to work on things so I hope that that cleared a little bit up about like what's been going on in a lot of the Love Island couples who's up to what um I do want to say too not a couple but a friendcation type deal uh me Kira Alex and Mallory um are all gonna be going on a cruise end of March actually which will be super fun we're gonna be leaving from Miami going to uh, Bimini in the Bahamas I hope I pronounced that right I feel like I always pronounce things wrong but yeah mostly um, that's like kind of what's up to date with most of the Love Island couples and like at least the the fi the couples you saw in the finals. I know too um, Cormac was dating someone for a hot minute and then they parted ways and he is back in Ireland now, single, back on the market from what I hear. Um, let me think of who else um, I have any updates about. I see, I actually see Kelsey crushing it on Instagram. She is super into all her fitness videos, so if you haven't seen those on YouTube yet, go and check those out. She is super motivated and seems very happy, so that's great. I also know around um, when the reunion was happening that Eric and Alana were like lightly talking or seeing each other, but I don't have any updates on that for you. I don't think that's something that they're moving forward with. I think it was very light, but then again, I haven't really stayed too in touch with the two of them to have enough of an update to confirm anything with them to you guys. But yeah. Well, if you have subscribed to my channel already, thank you so much. I've enjoyed all the support you guys have had for me, and please go watch any of my other videos. Leave me comments, leave me likes, go follow me on Instagram. I love seeing everybody. Um, I might have something special event-wise coming up, so stay tuned for that. And then also, wait, there was another thing I want to say. Oh, also my shirt is from Revolve. I'll link it below. I absolutely love them as a brand, as a company. I think their clothes are so cute and fun. They did not like sponsor this video or anything. This is just like an update video that was requested by you guys that I wanted to film. Then again, I want everyone to keep in mind, although I gave you updates on these couples, like I am still not in their relationship. So, you know, things could be slightly different or changed since me talking about this, you know, like I am really only going to know my relationship with like my friends, family, you know, romantic relationships at the end of the day. So that's really just something personal too. So I just want to, you know, make the disclaimer that like I don't know everything. I don't always, you know, what I say goes. Things could be different, but this is just like from what I have heard and what I've been told and am in the loop with and speaking with. 
So yeah, I'm really glad that you guys watched this. If you made it this far in the video, leave me like two smiley faces down below. Um, please subscribe to my channel and I'm really looking forward to sharing more videos and content with you guys. Please continue to send me more ideas and look forward to my upcoming videos because I moved to LA in like nine, eight days. So yay, that's so awesome. Wish me luck. I'm so nervous, but really, really excited. And I look forward to seeing you guys soon. Bye.